word on the street. So they say that Honeycomb Brazy has rejected an offer from J. Prince Sr. allegedly to return to Houston and he made his public, which is really crazy, right? It's really crazy right now because Honeycomb Brazy decided to, to kept it, you know, moving and go back to Alabama because people of Alabama is showing him more love than Houston ever showed him. So Honeycomb Brazy jumped on Instagram and he made this post and say, I'm probably never going back to Texas. I don't think it's for me. I just got some people I love down there, but I'm never coming back. That way, for real, Ninja really played me to that left while I was in the cell. He's like them boys was kicking me while I was down, tough shit. And I can never respect it. I mean, like, I never respect it. Now, listen up, man. They say that these, these messengers, after J Prince called him to return to Houston, and allegedly, right? This allegedly. And this is really going crazy because you all know the beef between Honeycomb Brazy, Prince family, and Mob Ties, right? It's really going crazy. The only person that Honeycomb Brady, Brazy is still cool with right now is Jazz Prince. I mean, big shout out to Jazz Prince, man. He always does things differently from the whole family business, right? Because, you know, that's how real men do. You don't gotta do some stuff that your family do. If they do crazy stuff, man, you don't have to do crazy stuff for them. That's why I have a lot of respect for Jasper. So, listen up, man. They said allegedly, what on the street, that J. Prince Sr. called Honeycomb Brazy to return to Houston and come back to rap a lot of mob ties and keep rapping the record label and for them to keep doing business musically and stuff like that. But Honeycomb Brazy, letting us know on this post he made on his Instagram page, right, saying that he probably not going back to Texas. I don't think it's for me, right? Because after he got locked up and none of them showed him love, none of them supported him, you know how crazy the world can be. That's why I keep on telling you all to make sure you focus on yourself, to make sure that you show yourself some love. Think about yourself, bro. Because at the end of the day, these are the people who you're doing stuff for. When it gets to your turn for them to do same favor for you, they're going to turn their back on you. And that's what Honeycomb Brazy was feeling when he was still locked up. He felt like none of them showed him love. None of them did this. None of them did that. None of them looked out for his family and stuff like that. So how could he just possibly go back to Houston right now, Texas, right there? It doesn't make no sense, bro, right? Because these people never showed up for me. Why well, would I show up for them? I mean, it's all crazy at the end of the day. So they say that he responded to Jay Prince Senior, man. Jay Prince Senior asking him to come back to, to Texas. That, you know, he's going to get some money. He's going to do this and do that. You know, for them to go back to the same game they were playing. But Onikon Brazy wasn't feeling that, right? Onikon Brazy let us know that he's not going back there, right? They left him hanging. He also said in this post that, you know, he never respected that. That he's like they were kicking him while he was down right that he doesn't respect that that you know he was locked up none of them was looking out for him none of them was trying to keep his name alive and stuff like that and you all know that Honeycomb Brazy made a diss track dissing finest two times I think Genium Motors and stuff like that in the new song and the song got over 1 million views in 20 hours I mean that was crazy bro so right now they they looking at that numbers right they're looking at the numbers they're seeing those money bro you gotta know what what one million views in 20 hours can 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 give you right that, that's a lot of money at the end of the day so they're looking at those numbers man they, they're seeing potentials they're seeing that honeycomb Brazil is still holding it down the fans are still supporting him and he's going viral right now anything you do about honeycomb Brazil on social media that she's going crazy it's going viral so Everyone want to check up to see what's going on with Honeycomb Brazy. So, listen up, man. It's all crazy at the end of the day. So, we all have to realize what Honeycomb Brazy was trying to achieve, right? He's trying to stay independent now. He's trying to, you know, handle his business. He's trying to make sure that he doesn't go back to people that never showed him love. He's trying to make sure he keep it 100. And he's trying to put Alabama on the map, right? Because right now, he's rapping Alabama, right? Being one of the you know, rapper right now that drops song in 2023, right? And in 20 hours, the song is already trending on YouTube. 
I mean, that was really crazy, right? So big shout out to Honeycomb Brazy. But remember, these are legendary, man, because this video is for entertainment and educational purposes only. And if you're new to the channel, do me a favor, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on notification bell so you'll get notified whenever I drop a new video. If you're feeling generous today, you can send a super thanks to the channel or you can join the channel membership and I'll give you all a very big shout out whenever I'm making my new video. And if you're a member in the channel, you get to watch my video first before any other person in the channel actually watches the video. And that's a way of showing you all appreciation. Thanks for checking up on the channel. Thanks for supporting the channel. I appreciate you all, man.